Hey everyone, welcome to Oso Veganish. I am Oso Mimi Moshidi, and we're going to cook some plant based food today. So, I'm going to show you guys what I'm cooking, and you're going to let me know if you like it or not. You're going to probably try to cook it yourself, so you may want to pay attention, alright? Alright now. I use Earth Balance soy free butter when I would like some butter and margarine in my dishes. You don't have to use it. You know, I'm the traveling fake vegan, so I went to the market and they didn't really have some things I wanted, but I did see this, so you know, I wanted to use this instead of oil today. You can use oil if you want to, I just didn't want to. You know, this is, I'm eating this, you're just watching it, so. Let's turn this sucker on. You know, I usually don't cook with, uh, what is this, electric stoves, but I'm in Florida right now. I'm all, you know, like I said, I'm traveling, so. Today we're in Fort Lauderdale, you guys. All right. Nice weather, you know. Got some iguanas in my yard earlier when I was coming from the grocery store or the market, whichever. I rode the bike to the market. It, it was a bicycle and it needed an alignment, honestly, but it got it got me there. Had a little basket and a little bell on it. It's cute or whatever. Alright, so I was trying to figure out what I want to do with these carrots. And I think, so they're like, can you see? They're tri-colored carrots. So I was trying to figure out, do I want to do like a coconut cream carrot thing so I think that's what I'm going to do that's what I'm going to do and I'm just using whatever I have available to season my carrots I want it to be like a, a sweet and savory flavor with the carrots um you know you can do it how you want to do it that's how I want to do it. I put a little sea salt on them as well. So basically I made some rice earlier too. Just some Spanish rice. And I'm going to add some stuff to that too. So I got some black beans and I got some chickpeas or garbanzo beans. And I got some I roast the corn somewhere. So, you know, this is also vegan-ish, okay? You don't have to be a vegan to eat this. You don't have to be a super vegan or super vegetarian to, to get an idea of what you want to eat for dinner. I'm just showing you some ideas of what you can get from the market that's on hand. You can stretch it out. I got a pack of baby carrots for like $2. It's probably a little bit more, but yeah, whatever. So I got some. Wait, what's that noise? Y'all hear that? What's that butter? Butter burning. It's not burning, but you know, it runs. So. Basically, what I'm going to do with this pan is saute some onions and some mushrooms and some spinach and some peppers. And that's it. And I got some flour tortillas, so I'm thinking, you know, you guys can watch me make tacos. So I'm chopping up garlic, but the garlic goes in like last because you don't want it to burn. I got some mushrooms already cleaned. And when you clean your mushrooms, you want to use a damp rag or like a paper towel and just massage all the dirt off and get it from like the in, 
inside. You know, some people like to clean their gills case by case. These were pretty clean, so I, you know, I feel like doing all that. But either way, it's a, it's a fungus. You're gonna eat the mushroom or not. Come on. I'm gonna just dice some mushrooms or slice some mushrooms rather. Get ready to throw those in the pan with my onions. Because I want those to cook down at the same time. Then I'm gonna add some peppers. And then we should be good to go. Mix everything together. So. Stick on you guys. 